Today we're gonna be doing something really cool. You see how this bad boy has little sparkles around him? That's because this is a special item. Not because it's just special, it's just a good item in general. The reason it's special is because it has a tainted counterpart. Today we're gonna be playing with tainted treasure room items. And once you pick one of the items that has a tainted counterpart, it is now set in stone for the rest of the run that you can find one of these tainted treasure rooms and find them. So hopefully, by the end of this run, we'll be able to find something. That being said, uh, Tech Zero is just a really good item, uh, and it will probably help us out throughout the rest of the run until we do find what we need to find. Go in the curse room right away, red row, oh, hello, oh my god! Alright, this is actually just a good start in general. <laughs> it's not even a tainted planetarium thing, this is just a great start. Hello Duke. Duke should be easy, plus we got a half a heart, so I'm not too afraid of dying now. Also, we just have Tech Zero and <laughs> uh, Incubus, so oh, it's pretty good. Today, I choose to go and get an HP up and go to the normals because I'm a little quirky today. Boom. Oh! Wait a second. I. <laughs> Would it be. <laughs> Wouldn't it be crazy if I just didn't find a Tainted Planetarium and I was just like, you know what? This is just a crazy run. We're just doing this today. Oh, that is insane damage. Oh my god, that damage is crazy. <laughs> Pin, no, you shouldn't be here. It's not safe. Marbles is good. I might just want to take that. And honestly, if I get a lump of coal, uh, that's really good. Especially with a build like this. Coal? Coal! You know what? This is a great run! Unexpectedly, just a sick run. Okay, uh, marbles is really good and I do need a trinket, so let's just take it. Uh, that's good as well. Okay, never mind. Let's just go. What? I don't even know what this video is about. Who knows what the video is about? Flooded caves. There you go. There's a dice room. I believe this is supposed to maybe be a tainted planetarium. That or it's literally just a dice room. <laughs> There's my regular treasure room. Uh, it's gonna be really dumb because I could, I don't know, maybe that really is just the dice room. Never mind, we're good. I can do whatever I want because I just got a golden key. Let's see, is that really the tainted uh, treasure room or am I am I just crazy? Is there no such thing as the tainted treasure room and I'm making it all up in my head as we speak? And in here, it is a tainted treasure room. Tech Organal, what, what is that? Okay, so I guess you get the technology version or sorry, you get the tainted version of whatever item you initially picked up. So if I wanted to get like tainted godhead, I would have to pick up godhead. Tears and bombs will be connected to you with a beam of electricity. What? Tears deal 33% of your- wait, electricity deals 33% of your- well, that was a really awesome sound. Oh, I see. It's connected to me now. Look at that! Okay, cool! Alright! We did find a tainted treasure room. Cool! Okay, let's play along with it then. You will not be living. I need to pay attention to Forever Alone, by the way. I picked her up randomly. I didn't really say anything. Ow. Alright, there you go. Bambino's gone. Thanks for showing me that. Tinted rock. I'll take a speed up because I feel kind of slow and then roll this. Sanguine Bond, and eh, that's okay. Guppy, I'll take the Guppy just because I'm already locked into double deals and maybe I can become Guppy. But other than that, that's kind of poo poo. Then we'll go, all right, super cool. Tainted treasure rooms, huh? Another double key, but we know this is not a tainted thing. Open that, soul lock it. I mean, teardrop charm. <laughs> uh, that's a really good item, but I don't really have any use for it. Curse of Darkness Flooded Caves has got to be one of the worst combos I've seen in Isaac, how dare you. That being said, this is really just such a dumb run. <laughs> you were talking about the start that I had? I found an Incubus and a Hamalacria. What kind of... I, I had a Jacob's Ladder. Next thing you know, there's a... Okay, well, that's actually really good because I was conjoined. I was going to say Polyphemus, but if I get conjoined with this, that's arguably better. Braille should be no problem. That is literally unavoidable damage, and that needs to be fixed. <laughs> I know you said no updates, but like that one... Can, can we get an update on that? Can we make sure that he can't do that? Because that's unavoidable damage and I would hate if that were to happen to me in a Tainted Lost run. I'm pretty sure they coded it so that can't happen. That's never happened to me in a, quite many months and years. So uh, maybe that was just a one-off thing. I'm going to say that was a one-off thing and that usually doesn't happen and forgive the game. However, I do know where my super secret is. It's right there. Tactically using my, uh, whatever the name of the item was. Oh my god, there's a star's card. Do you have a sacrifice room? But 
I already spawned a deal. So what I think I'll do is take stars with me. It removes the first item that you have and now because tech zero is gone, I'm assuming it's gonna take away Incubus. So we won't do this till the very end of the game. Health up. That is what you wanna see. I don't know my health. In fact, I haven't really been paying too much attention to it just because I know I really can't die. But it is something I have sort of mental note of. Mystery sack. That's just good in general. This can be used for rigging pretty often. And here, uh, I really like Vasculitis, but it's Bumbo! Hi Bumbo, take that coin. Oh hey, cool, so I'm gonna roll. Oh hey, Gimpy, cool. That plus d6 means uh, we might even be able to access infinite rerolls. Anything, I'm, I gotta know, right? Sure, I'll do it. I know I have good uh, pills. Infested, tears up. We got a pretty fly, those were absurdly good. Nice. By Singe. Deal? No deal. That's fine. That means I just have a roll for the next one. You gonna show me where the super secret room is? I didn't really pay attention. There you are. Actually, I don't have a bomb. Uh, then we'll just go. I'm having fun with this run. For some reason, it just feels like a classic madman time, you know? I'm having a great time. What is that doing here? I turned it into a monstrous tooth. I'm gonna be real. There's no way I would have used it, so I might as well have rolled it. Roll you. Oh, hey! Yes, 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 yes. That's beautiful. Come here, darling. Hello? Oh! That's just, that. that's actually just C-section. No, that was just C-section. Oh my god, look at the synergy. Because I get electricity coming out of my body, now the new tech item has actually been upgraded. Don't be an item, you're gonna tempt me to do it. I can't, I'm sorry. I so badly want to do this, but it wouldn't be good. I'd literally get rid of Incubus. That would not be smart. Let's not do that. C-section, Hamalacria, Incubus. Okay, I mean, I didn't need this kind of crazy run to be able to showcase the Tainted Treasure Room, but, I mean, if you wanted to give it to me, I won't complain. So thanks, video game. That looked like it exploded, but it literally didn't. C-section hasn't been showing up a lot recently, so I'm very happy to see it. It's kind of like an old buddy, you know? I, I still get comments on my oldest, oldest, oldest video. Uh, we got a double room. Let's go down. Maybe roll this. Goat head? No, I'll just take it. I still get comments on my oldest, oldest video. It was how I cheese dead god in Binding of Isaac Repentance. It was like, I think one of the worst thumbnails ever conceived in Isaac history. <laughs> but I thought, I don't know. I, I thought it was a funny video uh, at the time. And people to this day comment on it and they're like, Oh, you could have done this. You could have done this. Why didn't you craft C-section? And while yes, there's a lot of criticisms that uh, could be taken from uh, that video because I did bozo a lot, I feel like a lot of people didn't know that back in the day, uh, C-section, the sprite work was there in the game, but C-section did not function. It, on release of Repentance, C-section was not a thing. It didn't work. That's why the only way to get Dead God on release for Repentance was to find it through death certificate because death certificate has every item in the game. C-section didn't belong to an item pool. It didn't have an item pool. It wasn't ready. Uh, they probably just weren't expecting people to grind uh, Isaac that much to the point that they would get dead god within a couple months or whatever. Oh my god, a soul of a thing. So that's my story about how I uh, bows. <laughs> but I, I think it's still cool that I get comments on those old videos. Now, if I could get just a fast fire rate with this, I will be living in heaven. Like, drop a soy milk. I dare you. Another key's great. There's a solar keeper and a fallen fight! A fallen fight? <laughs> that's just good item. Oh my lord. I want all of these. In fact, that's- look that! I feel like it would be, uh, disingenuous of me if I didn't take it and at least try it. Just because we are trying to have fun with the mod. That solo, the keeper was ass, by the way. Dropping two coins. Hello, beautiful. Vine boom, vine boom, vine boom, vine boom. You're broke. <laughs> Thanks for showing me the secret room. Thanks for... What? What is with the secret room items? Again, like I want to do this, but I can't. I guess I'll just roll this. Like that might even just be good. Because I don't even have flight. I don't know if I can- wow. Hey look! Turns out that probably has a, uh, a tainted variant too. I don't know what it does, but cool. I am curious at what this demon shell beggar is uh, selling, but I don't think I'm curious enough just because I'm running soul hearts only. That's kind of scary. 
All right, tons of keys now. I'll just spend my last two or 10 cents on the crane game. See if I get it, probably won't. Oh well, okay, we did. Tech point five, no. Okay, you know what, I'm taking it. Just cause it's just such good stats. Uh, and then we'll take this eternal heart on the way out. Try and stay as far away as possible so the lump of coal scaling comes into play. AWAS is cool, I don't know if I have time to do this. My brain power is not working. I want to roll this. Oh! We're taking all of that. Also, Mom's Knife has a Tainted variant. I kind of want to know what that is. Too bad I probably won't. Uh, Backstabber is insane, especially with C-section. Hurry up and give me a crawl space. Uh, I can't see anything too very specific that I can use for a crawl space. Oh my god, I'm running out of time. Please, hurry up. Let me in. Anything useful. It's conjoined, I think. Oh my god, I have to. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Four, three. Two, one, oh my god! Uh, matchstick, matchstick. <laughs> matchstick and stud finder. We don't need stud finder, whatever. Probably time to level up Bumbo. This is one of the best items you can actually get with C section, so that's sick. Maybe there's a battery in here to roll that? There it is, okay. We'll do this. Roll. Demon baby. Kinda already have conjoined, but sure. I'm gonna pick up the stud finder and blow up these rocks. Hopefully, get a crawl space. We'll fight Hush. With the build that we have, uh, I literally just got Mob's Knife, Backstabber, Flat Stones. <laughs> this is, uh, it's gonna be pretty easy. And look at this. Now it really looks like the Tainted uh, Treasure Room item is being very effective. Previously, it didn't really seem like it just because I, you know, I gave up uh, Jacob's Ladder for it. Or Tech Zero. And uh, it looked like it wasn't doing too much. Now, it looks like it's doing all of the damage, actually. Hush is gone. That was like... A 10 second fight. Alright, let's go down. Nice. Alright, well, if you're gonna do that, we won't bounce. We're actually gonna look around for rerolls. Oh! Okay, alright, I mean, that's pretty good. Wait, can I get tainted treasure room items from the death certificate room? Hold on, let me look around. I'm pretty sure a death certificate always gives you every single item in the game, even if it's modded. So logically, Tainted treasure room items. I mean, I don't know what these items are. Oh, these are! These are the tainted treasure room items! We, we, I can get, I can get literally what everything. I, I can get whatever I want. I want to read every single one of these. I don't know what to get! Is that Godhead? Evangelist? Okay, I gotta figure out. Okay, hold on. Quality 4, quality 4. Here, Little Slugger. You are- that's a Meat Boy reference. That's really cute. I love that. You are- you fire piercing saw blade tears that deal repeated damage as they pass through enemies. So these will revolve around obstacles and walls that they hit. That sounds awesome. I don't know if that's working with C-section though. Okay, quality 4, quality 4, quality 4. These are all so cool. This is Polly, right? Tears are fired in a large clusters which split when hitting an object. That sounds like that would synergize really cool. I think logically I gotta take like this. That or the static tier. No, I'm gonna take the Polly. Are you joking? I'm hoping that it's gonna work. Assuming that my tier 8 is so... That it works it does it's insane it's one of the best items i've seen may as well use this in the secret room and we also still have a stars card to use for more rigging skeleton key you know what sure why not so i feel like i i this was actually about as effective as things could be because not only oh, okay dude not only did i become guppy uh not only did i effectively find a tainted treasure room, naturally. We were also able to showcase every single one of the items. We saw every single one of them, just because of death certificate, which was, uh, that's awesome. Dark room, guppy, guppy. Oh my God, Ayapalaya would probably go so hard. Oh, I can't really, I mean, I feel like I just can't. My health would be too precious. The guppy's definitely helping out with the AOE, so we don't feel like we're just not able to kill anything. So now I'm able to just clear. Oh. Oh! Walk in here with a full charge. Not to mention these bad boys have mom's knives attached to them. You know, just because. Maybe? Triple shot. Uh, sure? Oh, 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 oh! Guess who just found a dead cat? That is an insane item. You are- You are crazy if you think I'm taking that! <laughs> you are- You are insane! Oh my god, don't die. Whoa. Oh my god, they ran into death. <gasps> is that mysterious liquid? You know how insane mysterious liquid is gonna be? Holy mother of 
god, who survived? Let's get out of here. Lard, you know what? Sure. Okay, yeah, I'll go fight Delirium. Just because I want to see if I can kill him in one shot. It's like, I get to shoot once every two rooms. <laughs> That's how long the tier rate is. The, the room afterwards, I use only my flies to beat. And then only by then am I ready to shoot again. Only to just kill two worms, hooray. Oh god. Was that just an empty room with a stony? <laughs> I am so certain that I will kill Delirium in one shot. I am so certain. And if not one, definitely two. And now that I have the health to really sustain myself, I'm not too worried about losing either. I'm also curious about what happened to my reverse card. I know it's somewhere on this floor. I, I gotta use that. Well, it's gone. Number two. Give it a roll. Okay. Let's get a charge going and this should be Delirium. Guaranteed. Let's be real. I mean, look at that map. Hello, buddy. One shot? No. No, not one shot. But we did do about half his HP. So one more shot while he's in this form should be more than... Yeah, okay. It's a one shot if he's in his base form with no armor. That's such insane damage. Whatever that item is, poly... Polycrea? Polycrea? That's insane. Let me get that reverse card to use it and then we'll, we'll go. We get... Nothing. Okay. Well, that was awesome. Tainted Treasure Rooms is definitely a unique and fun playstyle for the game, and I really appreciate the mod maker. GG!